And welcome everybody here in, in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Tarek Lee. We've been playing all these index today. Um, playing this one here, this is probably the version that people were looking forward to the most. And uh, so I wanted to put this in the premium time slot, the, the morning time slot here, where we have Lee Sin with gems. We're only going to Gift Giver, but we're going to have our Gift Givers and our Mentor the Stones create gems for our Lee Sin. Going to be combining that with Tarek. Of course, whenever you support with Tarek, it does cast the next spell as well. So that's two casts as far as Lee Sin goes. Uh, gives Lee Sin, you know, the first one will give Lee Sin Challenger, the next one Barrier. So that works perfect there um we're gonna be playing river shaper in here i i mean i'm a big fan of river shaper i think drawing spells is a good way to win games so we're gonna have that in here another good card to support and help keep alive when we have cards like Tarek and mentor the stones that can support it um but yeah lots of lots of great spells a couple of hush a couple of will of ionia um a blessing of targon to go with that Tarek and Lee Sin and stuff like that um zenith blade this is a great one here, giving Overwhelm. Overwhelm with Lee Sin is amazing, especially when you have the Dragon's Rage, because not only will you Dragon's Rage and deal damage to the enemy Nexus with that, but then your Lee Sin will have Overwhelm and will just do regular combat damage to the enemy Nexus as well. All right, so let's go play our five games over in Ranked with Tarek Lee. So playing Lee Sin and Tarek together. <clears throat> All right, we got Twisted Fate and Swain. This is a very good deck. We're going to just mulligan the Hush. We'll keep our two champions and our Zenith Blade. Um, the Zenith Blade just goes really well with the champions. We need to find some earlier units. There we go. Perfect. That'll do. No, I don't like that. That means the one damage things will kill my River Shaper. So I do not like that. Alright, we'll just play the Mentor of Stones instead. So I, I want to have some protection available whenever we do play the River Shaper. I guess I could have challenged the Powder Keg. I was just excited that they passed turn. With that mana, I was I was excited for that. Yeah, so getting rid of that powder cake doesn't really matter. Who says I don't share? Each life a rare jewel. Do not want to see cooling strike at all. Don't have any other kind of protection against, you know, Culling Strike or anything like that. Yay! Well, that's very good. Extend your senses. That's too bad. Is all in the mind. My lands need me. Prepare yourself. So yeah, even if they kill Lee Sin with just you know another spell after this, they combine Twisted Fate and something else to kill Lee Sin. We you know we got another one. It's not the end of the world. Yeah, that's not the end of the world at all. Good, no ravenous flock. That's good to see. Brayfin. That card is awesome. I think I want to go River Shaper. That lets me like still play Deep Meditation this turn. No, maybe it's Lee Sin. Meaningless without skill. I've whipped up something special. I'll see this through. I 
will not hold back. They let me cast two spells and give Lee Sin a barrier. So that's very good. Endures. Their heart beats quick. Four out of eight. Alright, no block. Can't just take all the damage in the world. These Bilgewater Noxus decks are just really good at doing Nexus damage. They're very good at that. Ah, oh, they did have the flock. I was gonna, you know, use the guiding touch to help heal these things. Yeah, so just had a good hand. Yes, mentor oh, the stones. Stars. Speak, I say. Keep up, keep up. Mm. A little luck for those who need it. So I'm probably going to need to use this Guiding Touch on me. That would be my guess. They say these were from the Protector himself. Basically making this gift giver a 2-2 that can block that thing fairly easily. Destination in sight! Machines mean nothing to the dragon. Conflict is all in the mind. Through the coin! Done that thing. Yep, we got. We're gonna try to just do ten damage with the Lee Sin with the overwhelm. The dragon spirit awakens. That's the plan. Artillery barrage. All right, down to three. Okay, D meditation does cost um, three mana. Let's see, we're going to Sapphire, gem of our divine patron. Make that ten. My lands, prepare yourself. And there we go. I mean, that's Remember my that's words. the plan. I don't think we need to cast the deep meditation first. Yeah, double flock may get me, I suppose, but you know we'll have this and and be able to draw. You can't do this. So they're, I assume they're digging for noxion fervor. I like that they used all that, so now just like a noxion fervor doesn't kill me because we have the guiding touch. All right, GGs, one and one and zero. It was a good game. All right, another really good deck with They Who Endure. So no units. We probably need to find some units. I think I'm just going to keep Pale Cascade and Mulligan everything else as we look for some units to play. Um, I mean, I like Guiding Touch. I like Deep Meditation. Those do dig for us. No, I haven't tried the new. Oh my gosh, I'm so I'm sorry, opponent. I <laughs> I was just saying what I was gonna mulligan and then just didn't. Anyway, I haven't tried the new Lee Sin with Draven yet. You know, I've I've played Draven and Lee Sin a good amount in the past, but I haven't tried the new Lee Sin with Draven yet. I fight with my spirits, not my fists. We still get the two mana for these kind of cards if we need them. Not all mean well. Uh, 
River Shaper. Deny. No, can't deny that. We could deny that, but not going to. Um, no, no blocks. No blocks. This is really nice. Lee Sin Challenger with Pale Cascade. That is quite nice. Kind of wish I would have blocked now. I'll see this through. first. your spirit. No, it just makes sense to challenge this thing, doesn't it? This keeps Lee Sin a 3-4. Doesn't actually do any damage to Lee Sin. I wish I would have just traded, especially now that I'm drawing more River Shapers. We'll see how much that three life matters in the end. We swim within the flows of magic. Everyone's a garden. Definitely wish I would have just blocked. Alright, so we're gonna save one of these. Conflict is all in the mind. Act free of doubt. Ready yourself. What form will the waters take? A gift from the river folk. Alright, get some more spells. Thank you, river folk, for the spells. Lee Sin's at two. My plan is probably to play that and Guiding Touch, giving the Lee Sin a barrier, and it can challenge and kill the Wraithcrawler with a barrier. I'll see this through. This is kind of good how this works out with Lee Sin taking the two damage and then getting the barrier afterwards. I will not hold back. My lands need me. Center your spirit. Alright, well we, we won't um won't attack with the river shaper into the one four. Obviously. I feel pretty good about this. If they have They Who Endure, we have Will of Ionia to bounce it. Um, a little odd playing that right here, right? That's a they gotta be just setting up They Who Endure for what they're doing this turn. What is gained when we return malevolence? Nope. Conflict is all in the mind. Little luck for those who need it. These gems grant aware of All right, we will go to attacks now. Breathe in, breathe out. So I'm thinking. Okay, maybe that was a mistake with the gem there. Maybe I need to keep gemming Lee Sin. I was thinking like having like the two power thing that can fight here. Maybe I need to keep gemming Lee Sin. Patience is underrated. I will not hold back. Alright, burst spell and pass. Yuck. Burst spell and pass. I'll see this through. Kind of looking for more Will of Ionia, Concussive Palm, that kind of stuff. That's why I'm doing this card draw. My 3-2 just got burned. Don't have room for it. 
Does it make sense to pass and not let them? Conflict is all in the mind. All right, we got concussive palm. So we have concuss concussive palm plus deny. Prepare yourself. Remember my words. What am I doing? Attack with these things. And sure, you can just attack too. Just get out of here. Free up a spot. Okay. Not casting this gem, keeping the mana. So we'll have 10 mana next turn. Could be 10 important mana. So obviously I need to keep Deny available. For that card. So I guess the biggest problem will be if they have another atrocity. Okay, no, no other atrocity. Two and zero. Oh. Little odd tenth blade's awesome. All right, another Lee Sin deck. They're playing it with Nightfall. Going over to Diana. We're going to keep the Eye of the Dragon, Pellcast Cave. Let's get rid of the Zenith Blade. Um, let's just keep all of these. I mean, the Zenith Blade does a good job of replacing itself, so maybe I should just keep it. Even if I just put Zenith Blade on, like, Eye of the Dragon. <laughs> just give it a lot more health. We will resist. Ooh, that could be clutch against Lee Sin, and even against Diana. It's good against Diana as well. All right, so we're gonna be able to attack for a bunch next turn if I want to use my Pill Cascade. I guess so. Get a good attack for seven in. I'll give us a Dragling next turn. Don't really want this other Gift Giver. I'm glad I'm just playing two Gift Givers, because, like, Gift Giver is, like, okay. But it's not something you want to have a bunch of, and not something you really want to draw late. Breathe in, breathe out. So as you can see, I don't really need that other one in play right now. I'm just going to save the, the mana, because there's there's a possibility we needed that extra mana. Extend your senses. Maybe that should go on the 3-2. So we know that they cannot... They can't play two spells. Yeah, I was going to say, they can't play two spells. These jewels are more than mere trinkets. They say these were from the protector himself. Doing that to be able to get another spell for the extra draggling here. What is gained when you return malevolence? The dragon remembers. No, we save gift giver. So do they want to use two spells right now to try to to give their lease in barrier? We're halfway there on ours. Wow, they do. Pill cascade first. I'll see this through. I will not hold back. Hill Cascade first. Okay, okay. Don't get to draw that card, that's nice. Shall we dance, Lee? I'll follow your lead. So I have two hush available this turn. I'm surprised that they didn't have their 2-3 elusive block my 4-2, that they're willing just to take 4. I'm surprised by that. Conflict is all in the mind. This is 
not the way. Act free of doubt. Spring does not pity winter. I will not hold back. Gotta get my lease in that barrier. Conflict is all in the mind. Eight mana is an awkward number of mana to have when everything costs three and six. We basically just have to hope that we can play Zenith Blade, Zenith Blade, and they can't break it up. I think that's just my, my best choice here. I'd rather have like Zenith Blade stand united. Because we got to play two spells to level up Lee Sin. So that's why we're going this instead of Mentor the Stones. All in the mind. As the dragon wills. Ying Yue, you've been in my thoughts. Oh, Lee, you always did think too much. My lands need prepare yourself. So only two cards in hand. The gem doesn't matter. Can't cast that. So just two cards. You spurn my gift. Okay. I will not hold. That will keep them alive. Running. Protector. So they're at four out of eight themselves. Good time for Will of Ionia. No, yuck, not that. Hopefully they can't play four spells. Conflict is all and level up their Lee Sin. Cygnus. Or have that. Thank the mother you're yeah, Cygnus. You Cygnus looks good. Five three. Yeah, could have just used any spell. Okay, so back to Trundle. Weird hand? Question mark? The reason why I'm keeping the second Lee Sin is because the second Lee Sin is just going to be Sonic Wave, which I want Sonic Wave whenever we have these cards. Sonic Wave doesn't work perfectly with the uh, Tarek is like, you can't, you can't like give Tarek challenger and then give your next thing challenger and also challenge because you're in combat at that point. But we can give Tarek challenger and then also give Tarek plus two plus zero and then give the Lee Sin plus two plus zero because the Lee Sin will already have a challenger. I might have just played the gem, depending on what we would have drawn, I might have just played the gem on the 1 2 last turn. So if they have Trundle, I guess I want to play Lee Sin first if they have Trundle. Yes, yeah, so let's just lead with Lee Sin. If I had one more mana, I would be able to get the plus two plus zero and the gem three and make it six total. My lands need. That's not too bad. Those other two cards aren't that necessary. Let's save our spells. Tark has the tribeless. Don't worry, I am here. That's a lot of health over there. That's a lot of health. Uh, we could stun on the attack. Face. Hasn't seen that necessary. We're gonna hold on to the stun. Every gem you bestow reflects the beauty of our world. Each is made in your name. All right, so both of our <laughs> champions are at zero. Wow. Okay, that's good. That's good. 
let's see. All right, what do we want to do here? So we go blessing and blessing over here, then that's six. Um, so we are going to need to gem also. Make that seven. Hope crystallizes. I'll see this through. Remember my words. Sight firm. Center your spirit. Never submit. That was a good blessing of Targon. Harsh winds. <laughs> Why does it seem like they always have like the the best card? You just make up what's the best card to have here. Harsh winds? Okay, we got that. But can you float? I could certainly try. Build paint is just accidental art. Wow. Discarding Aurelian soul. I will not hold back. been in my thoughts. Oh, Lee, you always did think too much. Choose the right time to strike. Let's give... Our you, enemy you challenger? To preserve beauty and protect all life. Elisa does not have overwhelm. How's it the opponent's action? What are you doing, game? Why? Why does the time just go all the way down through the animation? Yeah, the timer just leaves through the animation, and so I, you can't... You can't stop that timer, it just goes really fast through the animation. Within my grasp. Ugh, that's horrible. Yeah, I mean, I can't... Nope. Can't do anything about it with that animation there. I really hope they change that, that the timer keeps going down during the animations. Because both the, the Tarek animation and the Leeson animation, those just kind of took a while and the timer was just going down during them. Really hope that's changed. Yeah, great for you. My plan was going to be to have that 5-2 challenge the, the Fused Fire brand. I was going to have this challenge the 5-7. That was going to be the plan. Man, that's so disappointing. We swim within the flows of magic. I guess we play you. Good chance I lose this because the timer ran out during the animation that you can't do anything about. My, how they stare. A familiar face for you, Rome Terran. Is all in the mind. I'll see this through. Keep their Aurelian soul from leveling up, I guess. Act free of doubt. Strike, we will reform.
Thank you, Big Alfredo. Thanks for the donation, Dak. All right, we're gonna need a large Lee Sen. Now they'll pay attention. Conflict is all in the mind. Conflict Deny Zenith Blade. Uh, so I can go Zenith Blade, and we'd have Deny backup. The Zenith Blade kills them, but then they get to play something. So like Infinite Mind Splitter doesn't stop me. Um, is there something that stops me? I guess that I. I think anything that stops me, I, I can deny. I think. Yeah, I mean, the Harsh Winds... The Harsh Winds would affect it either way, right? Like, whether I play Zenith Blade or not. So, like, that... The Harsh Winds doesn't matter. That's gonna hurt me either way. All right, that's denied. Look sharp. Prepare yourself. Unyielding. You're cool. All right, still one. Whew. No harsh. That was a hard-fought battle right there. All right, playing against the aggro deck. This Misfortune Gangplank deck is really good. I've lo been losing to it quite a bit recently whenever I'm playing against it. So we'll have River Shaper with Pale Cascade to protect it, kind of. Um, let's go with that. I don't, I don't really have cheaper. Yeah, I got two drops. Yeah, we we got we got ones and twos. Where's our ones and twos? And why do they have the attack token turn one? All right, come on, one or two mana card, please. Okay, that was a great draw because now we still have the two mana, so we could still have River Shaper Pale Cascade. No one's the wiser. That was just a really good quality card to have. Plus, obviously, you can get some draglings, maybe. Looking for trouble. It found you. So now, if I don't spend my two mana, everything's in place. Boom. If I don't spend my two mana next turn, I could go Taric Pale Cascade, double cast, you know, cast another Pale Cascade. And then we get a draggling for the turn after. That's tough. Or I, I play my Pell Cascade right now and kill this Misfortune. Strike, we will reform. Because I guess a draggling against Misfortune isn't that valuable. But we'll have a Pell Cascade to protect. Man, this is crazy. Turn Turn three, we have a blocker. And we're going down to nine. <laughs> turn three. A gift from the river folk. We have a blocker. I think this is my best way to win the game. All right, we're gonna play to win the game. Don't worry, I am here. <laughs> Never submit. Clear your head. That was a great draw. That claws of the dragon. Get on in there. So I still have the Nexus healing here. We'll have our Dragling. War Mason, reporting for duty. I'll do it on the Saboteur. Make the Empire proud. Getting like pre-nerfed Grenadier. Breathe in, breathe out. Well, we've, we've been drawing well. That's a good one. Oh, I need one more mana. For that Eye of the Dragon. We're going to have to play that next turn. Beauty charms while claws take hold. You lack subtlety. You act, but do not see. Mm. 
No. I hit the draggling. Yeah, I mean that was that was the perfect make it rain, right? Of hitting those those two things. I mean not the perfect, I guess we would have hit all three of those to be perfect. Explosives primed. Ouch. What is gained when we return malevolence? Or we'll be able to use that with the draggling, of course. This doesn't change a damn thing between us. <laughs> if you insist, shatter them. It is time. Wait, where are you at? You're at five out of seven right now. Okay. If it was six out of seven, I would have cast like a, or maybe cast like a guiding touch to level up first. Yeah, Vox gets to make Imperion now. That that's pretty sweet. That makes Vox even better. That Imperion being an, a huge elusive could be really important in different times. Yuck. Your king has returned. So misfortune's only at two, thankfully. Break their legs. Light them up. Huh. Okay. All right. So uh, you can block. The dragon binds us. Or let's see. Wait, wait, wait. I want you to block. You to block. You to block. No you stun here. All right. So right now that's us going to one. One's not a lot of life. Uh, you can just, I guess, block one of those things. Doesn't make that much difference. Um. So basically, I'm at five. I guess that should just block. Okay. Let's be now to three. Love ya. Damn it. I don't want to waste my mana, but I also don't really want to play my Guiding Touch first before they start playing Burn Spells, to be honest. Cover me, Crackshaw. You've got it, Captain. All right, don't want to waste the mana. Down to one. Ooh, that deny is really good. That stops Noxion Fervor. Um, so, I mean, I guess I can just play... Oh, no, no, I can't play the Zenith Blade, because we don't have the mana for deny then. I was going to say, I guess we could play it. Um, okay, so that now we're going to attack. You can support... Um, you with all your Overwhelm. Support you, I guess. Prepare yourself. Not all mean well. Patience should be fine. Gotcha in my sights. Well, I mean, we have lethal anyway without 
without giving them even the opportunity to play like an, anything else. I don't know what else they could have. We just we just don't need that kind of play for lethal. I thank you, dragon. There we go, Lee Sin looking good with gems. We even beat the aggro deck there. That was awesome. We did draw all of our guiding touches. <laughs> that that helped out a little bit. Um, uh, the Lee Sin kick. Lee Sin was going to kick there, and Lee Sin was going to win like that. I know my opponent can see before they got the animation, but you know we had the leveled up Lee Sin. It was going to challenge and do the Dragon's Rage. We were going to get that kick animation. Don't worry. Uh, but anyway, yeah, there we go. That's that's our deck. This one felt pretty good. I mean, Hush is awesome. Um, I don't. River Shaper wasn't bad. I mean, it it draws those spells, and you do need a lot of spells with this deck. You just want more spells a lot of the time. So, didn't get to do anything cool with Stand United. It's just a one of. It's hard to pull off. Like you know, we only drew Blessing of Targon one time, but it was very good that one time we drew it. Um. Or no, maybe we did get a, a Stand United trick. No, I think that was with the Lee Sin Zed deck earlier. But there we go. First time with gems with Lee Sin. I'd have to say a big, a big thumbs up. And uh, yeah, this one looked pretty good. All right, those y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there and uh, feel free to leave those comments. What other kind of Lee Sin decks you want to see? Anything about like the the YouTube channel? Anything you want to see? Um, you know, all that kind of stuff. I love seeing those comments, that feedback. Um, I I really appreciate it. Um, but anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.